and welcome once again to another edition of the Red, Brown and Williams Real Estate Show. I'm Shannon Deskins along with Jennifer Brown Day. And Jennifer, the last few days we've had a break from the rain and I think a lot of people are, are getting out and they're doing a little home shopping. I hope so. This is a great time to do it, a great time to start. Very popular time to start listing property, so you're going to see more pop up. Perfect mm -hmm. for those drive-bys. And also a perfect time to check out the brand new Red Brown and Williams mm -hmm. website. Uh, that is something you guys launched not too long ago, so we want to encourage everybody to check that out. Absolutely. And um, there's ways to look on there for listings, to get information about listing your current home, mm -hmm. all of our property management, rentals, auctions, everything is on there. All right, including the five listings we're getting ready to show you. And we show you four pictures out of every listing, but a lot of times you have many more than that on the website. So the website's a great second stop for anything you see here on the show uh, to get more information on. Absolutely. All right. The first one we're going to talk about is actually one of your listings. Mm -hmm. And this one, the price has just been reduced. It has. They have just reduced the price down to 219 mm -hmm. And this is one, this is going to be in a gated community in Pikeville. So 219 gated community, you can already tell that that's a really good deal. Right, and this is a motivated seller. They mm -hmm. have reduced the price, so they really want to move this listing. And I love this one because it's a round house uh, that is much bigger than it looks on the outside. It is. And this has over 1,900 square feet above grade and then an additional 481 square feet below grade that is finished. So if you look at that, you're close to 2,500 square feet. And if you drive by this house, you know, if you're in mm -hmm. the Foxcroft area and drive by it, you would never imagine that much space is available in this house. And one of the other things that I know you brag on this house is the way uh, that they've used the space. Because mm -hmm. normally on a, on a round house, you lose a lot of space by how they did their walls, but they avoided that with how this one was designed. Yes, this one was designed very, very smartly and it's a very functional, it has a huge living room. I think one of the pictures that's scrolling uh -huh. is the living room with the floor to ceiling windows. You can see how much space you've got. And then you've got a really nice kitchen that they've just updated, granite countertops, white cabinets, super bright. And then on that main floor, you've got a full bathroom and two bedrooms. So that tells you how big that main floor is. And then the second floor, which is the same size, is pretty much an entire master suite. This is one, again, I highly recommend that you set up an appointment to see the property. Okay, now this is your listing mm -hmm. in the, uh, the Foxcroft area, which is just mm -hmm. on the south end of the city limits of Pikeville. So uh, let's give the Pikeville office number so they can call you. Okay, that number is 606-437-2333. All right, the next one is also your listing, uh, but it's a little bit outside the city limits, up US 119. Yes, this one is in the Mita area. So if you go up 119, you're going to take the Kemper Phelps exit, mm -hmm. and you're actually going to turn right off the exit. Instead of going towards Kemper, you're going to go towards Mita. And this house sits not but a mile down the road. And that, when we say 119, a lot of people are familiar with Buckley's Creek Road. Uh -huh. uh, so you'll go up Buckley's Creek that becomes, that is 119. And this is one, it's a super cute cottage style home. It's a three bedroom, one bath. And this is another one, it's not a huge house, but mm -hmm. they have used the space very well. Yeah, I think this is adorable and you look at it uh, and you've got just over a thousand square feet. And that is a trend that a lot of people mm -hmm. Uh, the smaller house living, not a tiny house by any means, um, but it's smaller so if you're downsizing or you're, you've got a small family or you're just starting out and this is your first purchase, it is priced that it would work for any of those scenarios. Yes, absolutely. And this one, they've kept the cottage feel to it. They've done some updates. It's got a new bathroom in it, new tile flooring, but then they've also kept the original hardwood mm -hmm. through most of the house. They've got the marble tile fireplace that kind of keeps that old world charm. Yes. So it really has a lot of those old cottage feels, but again, it has been updated to accommodate a current family. You do have a fenced in backyard as okay. well. It's got a carport that you can actually pull two cars under. It's a front, uh, front to front carport right, right. so you, you're not side by side. And then you have an unfinished basement which is perfect for storage or if you wanted to do you know a workout room or playroom or anything like that that's extra space that's not already accounted for and then you've got the picture of the the swing the porch swing mm -hmm. there so you could you've got your outside time too uh, so this house offers a lot both inside and outside the country feel but not far from the city so i think this one's going to be attractive uh, for people also this one is priced 119.9 
also your listing, so let's give your email address. The email is jbrown at rbnw.com. Okay. Now, moving on, the last one that we're going to do that's your listing is a brand new listing. It is. And this one is kind of the same direction. Instead of going towards Mita off the Kemper exit, you're mm -hmm. actually going to go towards Kemper. And then you're actually going to take the right at L&M Mart, which everybody knows. It's like a landmark. Uh -huh. Um, and go towards Phyllis. And this one I like because you are out in the country a little bit, mm -hmm. but if that is your type of lifestyle that you want a little bit of a slower paced life, but you've got the access to Fish Trap Lake. And you're not but at just a couple miles from the entrance right there to Fish Trap, which also has that park mm -hmm. and all kinds of stuff right there. So it's a great area for families, young families looking for a little outdoor space as well. I mean you're getting a house that's got over 2300 square feet so mm -hmm. this is a very large home uh, and it's very spacious on the inside. It is. This one has five bedrooms, two full bathrooms. Now uh, in addition to those five bedrooms you have a downstairs living room, an upstairs living room, an wow. office upstairs um, and then of course you have your kitchen, dining room, you know those typical rooms. This is one that if you have a growing family, this is mm -hmm. going to be a great opportunity. Or the way it's set up, if you would want to have a lower level and an upper level, mm -hmm. you could easily add a kitchen upstairs and you've got two separate living areas. Wow, this one has got a ton of options. And then looking at the outside, a lot of people are going to fall in love with that gazebo. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, the gazebo sits right in the front yard. What's not included on the pictures right behind the gazebo, you have a very large storage space and then you also have a carport area. So you have a lot of space outside as well to store whatever you would need to do. This one is as attractive already uh, to anybody uh, who likes this area, who mm -hmm. doesn't mind a short drive uh, to get to Pikeville. Um, but a lot of people don't mind the commute just to be able to have that peace and quiet and, and being out there. 15 acres, everything mm -hmm. we just told you, almost 2,400 square feet for under $100,000. Yes. That is not a typo, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> and that is 15 acres that already has an additional house seat on it. Used to have a mobile home on it. So if you wanted to put something else there, you've already got that ready as well. All I can say is wow on this one. This one is somebody that has priced this home because they want to sell it. Yeah. Absolutely. All right, 97.5 for this one. Uh, now this one is your listing as well. So mm -hmm. let's go ahead and give that Pikeville number one more time. That number is 606-437-2333. All right, we're going to switch realtors for the last couple of listings mm -hmm. and we're going to show off a couple of Beverly Newman's listings. Yes, and um, Beverly is one of our newer agents and she has a brand new listing that is on Robinson Creek. Right, and this one is one uh, that a lot of people, if you're a horse lover, you're going to really find this one attractive because you've got a horse ring, you've got some huge horse barns here. Yes, this is one, the house is awesome, the house mm -hmm. is great, but the, what's going to sell it is going to be the horse equipment and the horse <laughs> yeah, the lifestyle. I mean, when we say horse barn, we're telling you it is a 15 stall horse barn. Yes. A heated and cool stall. So, this person that designed this and built this loved their horses. Yes, absolutely. So going back, this is going to be a 2,600 square foot house, three bedrooms, four bathrooms, three car garage. Uh, it is a ranch, which is very popular, a brick mm -hmm. ranch. So um, easy access and all that kind of stuff. You know, if you love to have friends over, or if you love to, and you're looking to maybe do a business mm -hmm. uh, that involves anything with horses, you're going to be able to do that here, and it's on the same property as where you're going to live. Absolutely. Uh, so it's not going to be that you have to live one place and commute to take mm -hmm. care of your horses or, or do anything like that. It's all in, in one stop right here in Robinson Creek. And if you want a second business to run out of your house, uh -huh. this also has a dream kitchen with all commercial appliances. Oh, wow. So if you are just love baking or if that's something that you want to look at doing again for an additional business you have that as well. This one you know a lot of people's heads are spinning in so many different directions on this one. This one is just we call it the opportunity listing. Yes <laughs> absolutely. Because you have all of that a three car garage and then from where it is on Robinson Creek is just off of US 23 mm -hmm. not very far so that's close to Pikeville um, so you're getting everything that a horse lover would want in a great location. Absolutely. I'm going to kind of do a rundown of all the amenities. It does have an in-ground pool, a 40 by 60 detached garage large enough for an RV and cars, a garage that is heated and cooled and has a living space above it, and then it also has the 120 by 36 15 stall barn that's heated and cooled as well. 
Wow, and it's also got a wash bay for your horses, and mm -hmm. it has hot water. <laughs> so they're not, like I said, this person loved their horses. <laughs> uh, they're even going to have a hot bath. Uh, so this is one, if this has got your wheels turning, that or for the commercial kitchen that we mentioned, 549, which is a steal for everything you're getting. Yes, in this all is honesty. very unique property and something that you really need to call at and look at if that's what you're looking for. All right, now let's tell everybody how to get a hold of Beverly. Let's give that office number. Okay, the office number is 606-437-2333. All right, now we'll switch gears a little bit. Stay with another one of Beverly Newman's mm -hmm. listings, but we'll go from a 15-stall horse barn <laughs> to a townhouse. There you go. A little bit different. This is actually at Lancelot Court, which is in the city limits of Pikeville. Mm -hmm. And this is just a super convenient, low-maintenance house. So if you're coming into the area, if you want to downsize, this is going to be where you go. And this is on Cloy Creek. So mm -hmm. uh, if you're accessing, uh, looking at the Elkhorn City area, the Millard, Shelbyana area, you just cut through Cloy and you're right there. But of course, it's still in the city limits of Pikeville. This is one that a lot of people would love to live, but these things don't come open very often. They do not. Um, they don't come open very often, and especially not an in unit that comes open very often with private parking. So right. this one has its own carport, which if you're familiar with that area, is not common. Mm -hmm. So it's got the carport, you're on the end unit, a lot of privacy, more quiet. And I've actually been in a couple of these townhouses there at Lancelot, and they're a lot more spacious once you get inside mm -hmm. than you realize. They really are. This is a two-bedroom, two-bathroom, so the bedrooms are upstairs, mm -hmm. and because it's a two-bedroom and not a three, you're getting very spacious bedrooms. So that is a major plus on it. And then you do have a um, bathroom on the first floor, along with utility, kitchen, living room is all right there accessible from the first floor. Wow. So this one is one, again, if you're looking for low maintenance living mm -hmm. uh, as far as, you know, not the big yard or if you travel a lot or if you just want to downsize, uh, this one is going to be great. Again, it's an end unit. So mm -hmm. uh, this one is going to be attractive to a lot of people, I think, if they're in the market for this. The price, 132000 not bad at all. Not bad at all. And again, it's Beverly's listing. Mm -hmm. So you can email Beverly if you want more information. Her email is bnewman at rbnw.com. And again, we want to stress, you know, that everything we just mentioned, uh, you can see on the new website. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about that website in just a minute. Okay. So it, it's going to feature everything Red Run and Williams does. And normally when you think about a, a realty company, you think they're going to buy and sell houses. But you guys do much more than that. Yes. So it's got, of course, that information mm -hmm. on there. It also has information on any educational services that we currently have going on. We do uh, education for real estate and appraisal. Mm -hmm. It has all of our auctions, any upcoming events, open houses, auctions, anything like that. And then all the property management we do. We do commercial and residential property management. So all that's on there as well. You, you guys do it all? We try. <laughs> okay. And as normal, when we end the show, uh, you take a minute to educate mm -hmm. the people about something else about Red Run and Williams. So I'm going to step out now and let you do your real estate minute. As we get closer to spring, the listing season will pick up. If you're planning to list your home, now is the time to start preparing. During these chilly days, take the time to declutter, including cleaning out closets, organizing spaces, and making each room look spacious. If you have rooms that need additional attention, now is a great time to repair small issues, paint, and update. As we get into warmer weather, move your focus outside to curb appeal. Then, when you're ready to move forward, make sure to call one of our RBNW offices to get your property listed. Our agents will be excited to assist you through the listing and selling process. Thank you for joining us for the Red Brown Williams Real Estate Show. We will see you again soon.